A child missing for hours after his high school or his van fails to drop him off at his stop. This afternoon, many are asking what went wrong after that five year old student is found alone hours after school, locked in a school van in the bus barn. New this midday, we're hearing from that family about their son and what about the district and its contractor, NCAP. KMTV Action 3 News reporter Shante Passmore has our story. Okay, bus belong to bus. She was really mad the bus broke but she want him to keep like like go to the court, but she said we're Christian, so she forgive him. Relief this morning after a horrible evening of worry that ended with this. <laughs> A mom and dad gripped with fear when their five-year-old son, Samuel, didn't make it home from school until after 9 p.m., following a citywide search by officers, Able One, and Omaha Public School employees. I was very much happy because I was expecting that I'll get my baby soon because uh, through the help of the police. Samuel is a preschooler at Field Club Elementary. He just started last month. We're told a teacher walks the students to the van at dismissal. What happened yesterday? Was it a different bus driver, different teacher? What happened? Things like a sub, a sub bus driver. It's like sub, yeah. So the bus driver was a sub? Yeah. That's what they heard from the mother of one of Sam's friends. The boys go to the same school, are in the same grade, take the same van, live in the same area. Samuel's family tells me usually the bus drops him off between 440 and 5, but that didn't happen Wednesday afternoon. Instead, he was here near 24th and Fowler, a little over more than four miles north of his home, nearly a 10-minute drive. Officers found Sam inside a van, alone and in the dark. He, he kind of scared for him to go to school now. <laughs> when asked whether Samuel will get back on the van, his family is still unsure. Shante Passmore, Kane TV, Action 3 News. Now, Omaha police say the driver of that school van that never dropped off five-year-old Samuel last night has now been cited for child neglect. Investigators interviewed the van driver, 61-year-old Claude Pope, who says that he had dropped the boy off at his home. Now, after searching for hours, officers went to the facility where the student vans are located and found the child sitting in a seat alone inside that van. Again, officers cited Pope for child neglect.